The offense had a complete explosion versus the Tennessee Titans on Sunday, winning the game 58 to 14. The Jaguars are carried by the leader guard in Minshew, who threw for 230 yards and five touchdowns. The running game was still consistent with LeSean McCoy, running for 160 yards and 23 carries, and DJ Chark was able to find the end zone twice on eight receptions. Outside linebacker Miles Jack came up big for the Jaguars with two sacks and one interception, and Josh Jones, recent free agent acquisition from the Dallas Cowboys, was one of the many spotlights on the Jaguars' defense tonight, securing three interceptions. The Jaguars are currently 2-0, and with the Dolphins coming to Duval in Week 3, the till journey does not seem to be slowing anytime soon. Having flashbacks of a shoot, I hit a nigga up in flat. So I noticed that the league is not on rookie, but evidently Josh Lambeau has a disability called Focus Kicker or Focus, and basically it like slows down his kicking meter, which I really need, bro. I'll, I'll miss a field goal, the actual game, but they never, they never let me. It doesn't register at least. That's a good pass. Uh, hey, Josh Johnson, bro. Josh Johnson and and Gardner, um, not Josh Johnson, Josh Jones and uh, Chauncey Gardner Johnson, bro. They have so they. I don't know what it is, bro. They just have so much range at that safety position. Maybe because like they both pretty fast and, and long, but they just have so much range. And I just throw I throw it back to them. Ah, uh, that's not my game. I mean, it looked, it definitely looked open. I didn't think he was going to jump it, but I also didn't think Gardner Mitchell was just going to lollipop it up there. That cover three, that cover three is because I, I ain't never played my ultimate team. Just you know, trying to see like how how I play and stuff like that. And with my with my little eighty three overall team, that cover three goes crazy. Can't do arm tackles. Can now arm tackle. Get a job, miss you. I fold. I folded you, miss you. That's just my PlayStation. If you have a PlayStation, you may, you may know the pain that I'm going through right now, bro. Just need a new fan and stuff like that. I can't wait till the PS5 comes out. I'm so glad he didn't pick that, bro. Miss you threw that late. Get right. Let's get right, miss you. Let's get right. Come on. Let's get right. Get your head in the game. You know he's running through the The dot, miss you. He's just running cover three, playing on that, uh, playing on that safety out there. Yeah. He's basically trying to do what, I, what I'm doing. The only difference between what he's doing and I'm doing is that, <laughs> you know, I, mean, I know, I know how to dot it up just a little bit. Ah, come on, get up field, get up field, get up field, get your yards, get your yards, get up field. Five. Come on. Come on, gotta get the first. Good, good.
playing really good defense right now. Can't be mad. Let's see if I get a little stretch. Yeah. Pretty good. Caught me over the middle. Uh, I think he played maker that tight end up. He tried to hit the uh, running back on that one. Would have been open, but he waited too late on it. So combat, I'm just put this guy in the flat. That's another pick. He's 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 trying to he's trying to beat that cover three down the seam, bro. But that, that quarterback's not making the throw as he want for him. Three. So we'll try that right now. Okay. Uh, uh, okay. He's playing it pretty well. Oh, uh, Chanel. And that's just that's just me playmaker. I knew that the driver's gonna get under cover cover three. It didn't get under it because I think he manned up Chanel or something. So I just waited. Playmaker it up. Touchdown. This is what happens when you uh you face slants. Uh calling the D lineman. He's going to slants again. This time he is the guy on the uh out. I mean the outlet. I'm gonna mix in uh this couple more robber. He's going to that slant play again. I knew he was gonna go to slants again. I just couldn't get out there. Like I couldn't, I couldn't play on my safety. So put him out. I'm playing the safety. Case I'm pressing R three to have him come down, but he's not. He's I don't know what he's doing. He's not coming down on that run it here. He doesn't try to run it. See tight end. All right there. He just he just makes a nice throw. I try to come down the running back and get a pick, but I just get a weird animation and he goes for the ball. And yeah, he scores. All right, there he just runs around. He just runs around my line, my lineman. I think he's like man aligning or something. I'm not sure. Chart. He's getting some real nice hit sticks. Good catch, another good catch rushing all. I possession caught it. I was hoping that he just got down. Because if he would if he would have got hit and uh dropped the ball, I would have been pretty upset. And I uh, like I said, I possessive caught it. Alright here, we're gonna try to mix in some more to run. Still wanna stay consistent with the run like me. So still try crosses. Right there. I threw it late. Um, Chenault's usually open on his cut. I think he's running cover two. I just threw it right when the tight end cut on that one. Like, <laughs> I'm, I'm watching his user. I see his user didn't move directly. I was like, okay, I'm gonna throw it right there to open it. It'll put him, um, put him behind 10 and hopefully behind 17. I'm, I'm perfectly okay with taking taking what's underneath and whatnot because my my job right now is to kind of like milk some clock. See so right here, I'm just oh, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get a little sticky with McCoy. But my job right here is just to milk the clock. Uh, I can score, but it's not it's not utmost important to me. Right here, I'm gonna try to uh, get underneath, get under that cover three. He's playing good. Uh, Stone at McCoy right there. I get bailed out. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm not gonna sit here and act like that was some some great play I did. I just got bailed out by Madden. But like I said, I'm gonna take I'm gonna take the flu every time. Now hopefully we get in the end zone right here with McCoy, man, on that strong power. He hasn't like the run hasn't been as deadly as it has in the past couple games, but he hasn't found a real answer for it. And McCoy gets into the end zone right there. So, not, I don't really fear this quarterback that he has. 
I don't really know the guy, but I don't fear him. Oh, One second, love. You know what I mean? He, he can go for the field goal, but I don't think he's going to get it. I could have played zone on that, but I didn't want the risk of the zone getting beat for whatever strange reason. Played man, I felt like it was the safest bet. And hopefully, yeah, we get a miss right there. Oh, why are you running? I wanted to return the kick, but we'll take it. Continue to run the ball, personally. I see that he's doing a lot to try to Right there, I don't know what's going on. I see that he's doing a lot to try to stop it. Like he's in this, he's in this uh, four three. Uh, I think it's four three six one. It's a real good uh, formation for blitzing, but it's not the best formation for stopping a run as against me at least. So right here, he's still running this cover three. Oh, miss you. I had X open, I had X and triangle open. I tried to like roll. I'm gonna put McCoy on this underneath route. Hopefully I get some shaking. Eifert. Bro, Eifert's been dropping that pass for me a lot and it's really starting to make me mad because in Madden 20, you throw that, he's catching the ball, he's diving down. Like this year, oh man, I whiffed on that. Bro, no, no, no. Just like that, it's a three-point game. I, I I can't I can't do nothing about that. In his pass, his pass defense, pass defense. But I'm still gonna run the ball on you. I'm not, I'm not gonna go away from it because if but as soon as you go go away from it, that's when you know I mean the bulls start happening. Like you start messing around and the punt gets blocked. You feel me? So still gonna stick with it. I don't know who that guy is, but that's Larry Fitzgerald. 146. McCoy getting a little sticky. I think he's running the Lions defense. He's either running the Lions defense or he's running the custom. But a lot of these formations are in the Lions playbook. And I'm just I'm just gashing them on the run. Honestly. Truly. Right there, like nobody picked up the linebacker. I don't know what is, what miscommunication that was. So it looks like he's running, man. This looks like man. Right here. I'm gonna tell you DJ Chart. He ran he ran very heavy, man. Like he had his uh he had his lineman and, and coverage and all that. So going back to McCoy. McCoy is McCoy is dog tired right now. Like he's really he's really tired of toting that rock. He does seem to have an answer for the run right now, bro. So I'm gonna just I'm gonna continue to run it. That's that's all I can do is continue to try to run the ball. Passing, passing, I've been straight, but Mitch, you like, I don't know, Mitch, you and my wide receivers with, with them dropping first downs like they did last drive, it kind of kind of makes me not want to pass it, really. I'm going to think that he's going to want to do the same thing I'm doing to try to like establish a run game at least because he, he just really, he literally just came out in the same formation I'm coming out in and it's like, okay, this dude's doing this, let me do it as well. Like, you feel me? Which I can't blame him. Especially is working right here. Nothing's open. Nothing's open. Nothing's open. I'm playing that. I'm pr <sighs> all right. But luckily he didn't catch that. But I, I literally played all three of those routes. They all ran to the same area. That's not a good route combo. I need this dude to make a mistake. I need a pick. Honestly. Pick would do me justice. He got that route going over the middle of the field. And he just he just dot me up. He got Devontae Adams at tight end. And he just dot me up over the over the field right now.
good stop. So right, right here, I know he's going slants. I know for a fact he's going slants. And we get a pick. I bump, I bumped the wide receiver just a just a bit. Should have been PI, but hey, it's Madden. I bumped him just a bit because I know he's going slants. And I don't know if you know this, but I tried to put my other safety on a purple so he had played the uh, other side of the slant, and it put him it put him in like a weird blue. I think that was like a mid blue or something, bro. But we get the stop, uh, we get the pick, and uh, now we in the driver's seat, man. Now, now I really, I really want to score the ball, but I'm gonna still take it slow. I like still playing heavy, man. I'm gonna probably add some uh, some different route combos. All right there. Oh my goodness. Yeah. That's why. That's why. Like when I pass, bro. Like I try to be as close to the sideline as possible. Somebody will fumble. As you can see there, somebody, somebody will fumble. And I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just run it with McCoy, bro. I'm gonna just run it with McCoy. He's the best running. He's the best running back in the. In the in franchise, bro. I'm telling y'all, he he was just sitting in free agency. He was just sitting in free agency, bro. But uh, I'll make I'll make sure they count for that this job. Underneath route. Uh, Clay Brooks. That's 94 speed. Like <laughs> he's been throwing picks all game. Like I know it looks open. I know it looks open, but I promise you it's not. Uh, I picked up, a, I think he was like a first or second year player, Thompson, another receiving back to uh, good first. Just in case, just in case McCoy gets like hurt or something. Picked him up. Man. We just, we just honestly just, uh, we honestly just managing the game right now. McCoy, McCoy is just running buck wild on him. Boy's going crazy on him. So let's see. Wasn't expecting the screen. Some somehow comes down on it. Nice, nice play by him. Nice play by him. Cover three. Yeah. Man, he's just he's just hit sticking, bro. <laughs> that's all I did. That's just that's just hit stick. I got I got Thompson in. So I, I know he's running cover three. I can't take a sack right there. I'm gonna go for it, dot. Right there over the middle of the field. Shark! I don't know what this is, bro. I don't know what that is. I think he's going outside. No, he's going up. Oh, that's a good play. I put the safety in a purple. But, just made a made a great catch right there. All right, there. He just hit me with slants once again. To do something here. I'm going to pass it. Because if I get a first down, it's kind of like game. Like that. It's kind of game, you feel me? <laughs> That's kind of game, you feel me? I think he played a cover three and played everybody down. I think he played underneath, which I don't know how you play underneath when I have so much field behind you, you know what I mean? But. Oh my gosh. I just, I threw a bad, I threw a bad pick. I threw a bad pick. I threw two of those, two bad picks. I thought Triangle was going to keep going over to the left and I could have hit him. But that was just a bad pick. Very bad pick. <sighs> but that's the game, man. <laughs> that's the game. Probably, that's the closest one we've had so far. The last two being blowouts. But um, I feel like we was in the driver's seat the majority of that game, too. Majority of this game, too. Like, I don't think he's ever, I don't think he ever had to lead. Closest he had was, it was 14-17. And it wasn't even that his offense scored. It was just off the fact that he had that, he had that, uh, block block punt touchdown which is bull but I can't I can't uh, 
I can't help that really. I Me, mean, yeah, man. I definitely feel like if I play him again, I'll blow him out. Because I'm going to know what to expect. Like, if he comes out in, those, in that Y, trips, HB week, he's going to throw it to the running back. All right, so next week we play the Bengals. Uh, the Bengals is uh, D. Chala. He's a he's a all right user. Like I wanna say he's one of the top users in the league, but he's he's pretty good. Like he, he can win a couple games. Um I think he's undefeated. Well, we're currently undefeated. The guy that we just played was undefeated, but he's not undefeated anymore. The Dolphins. Um The Bengals are currently undefeated right now. I don't know if it'll change when we advance. But that's the gameplay, man. That's week three. So hopefully we like I said, we just keep getting this chemistry going with the team. Um I really, I really like what I'm seeing out of the team. Not gonna lie, like I feel like they're playing, like, playing really good assignments or whatnot for it to be. You know what I mean, the Jaguars, <laughs> but playing good assignments. Uh, so far, my stats, stats not looking the best. Eight for four. I want to get them interceptions down. You threw four interceptions in three weeks. It's not that good. Sean McCoy, 414 yards, five TDs. I want to see who's top in rushing. Yeah, so currently right now we're number one in rushing uh, in front of Le'Veon Bell and Phillip Lindsay. So that's always good. I like I like being number one in certain stats. <laughs> I think that's kind of cool. And um, receiving, Shark, Shark and Chenault kind of neck and neck when it comes to receiving. Chenault get his first touchdown in that most recent game versus the versus the Dolphins actually. And then interceptions, Josh Jones. Josh Jones been balling. Six interceptions in three games, bro. People need to stop throwing him. <laughs> People need to stop throwing him. But it's your boy hitting on the full man. I appreciate y'all for watching. Appreciate y'all for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And we out. Peace. Uh, would you? Would you